Before the sun rose, all slumbered in the dark. Then the blade dancer appeared and created a gap to let in the light that dispelled the darkness. Through countless days and nights, a human form crushed by suffering experienced pain and distress until the light soothed and healed him. Everyone has experienced darkness, but few will forgo the memory of light. Embracing the sunshine of this era, the figure looms large in this poignant woodcut. This image, entitled The Master, is a representative work of modern Chinese woodcuts. With form and volume rendered in ink, the figure is realized through meticulously cut lines. With the raised areas covered in ink and then stamped onto paper, The image materializes to demonstrate the blade feel that is essential to the art of woodcuts. The master stands as a grand masterpiece, encompassing thousands of blade strokes. Actually, it is a very important part of Chinese art. The blade itself is not very big. 就是七十公分，但是呢，它产生的视觉力量却远远大于几米乘几米这样。在七八年重要的历史阶段的时候啊，给我们的这个意义是对人的一种啊重新的肯定。它是更简洁明快的强调了一种人的存在。Who is the subject of the woodcut? How was this image created? 首先要摆一摆多生多起来，没什么话。In Chengdu, Sichuan Province, veteran artist A Ge and Xu Kuang spend most of their day in the studio. Here, the master, which the husband and wife team created some 40 years ago. Still holds the place of pride. This work has been intertwined with their artistic career and life story. <笑>你把眼睛戴起来你把眼睛戴起来你把眼睛戴起来你把眼睛戴起来你把眼睛戴起来你把眼睛戴起来你把眼睛戴起来你把眼睛戴起来你把眼睛戴起来你把眼睛
In 1977, the year before China launched the reform and opening up policy, people had already sensed a change. A sign to create a woodcut about the peaceful liberation of Tibet. A Ge and Xu Kuang set out to gather materials and get inspiration in the autonomous region. 感觉一到拉萨以后，整个城市就是完全在一片音乐当中，就觉得没有见过这种场景。哎呦，那么多藏族人民在公园里面，就完全是在一个节日的海洋里面，所以大家去了就拼命的写生。Before 1959, Tibet was a closed and backward land, burdened with slavery and serfdom. Aga, who was born in a region adjacent to Tibetan area, saw many injustices while growing up. My grandmother was in Myanmar. The family was a little bit of a slave. The family couldn't stand it. She had to get rid of 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 it. The woodcut titled My Mother was inspired by this traumatic memory. Her maternal grandparents who were slaves in Mianming, were persecuted to death. At that time, Xu Kuang and A Ge spent eight months in Tibet under snowy peaks. They made hundreds of sketches, trying to capture the perfect image. Today, they can still recall the chance encounter with the subject of the master. In Dangshun Tsaoyuan, there was a Sai Ma Hui. I just met the Zhuang Gong Zhuang 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 A split-second snapshot recorded an image that would be immortalized. The Tibetan man might be a herder mending his fences, or a casual spectator of the race. But this posture was an embodiment of the hopeful new Tibet. In 1978, China was reviving its National Fine Art Exhibition. A Ge wanted to submit this significant work for the event. But just 10 days before the deadline, A Ge became unwell due to pregnancy and had to stop working on the master. My child is very big. Xu Xuanzheng gave me to directly the 然后我就说那背景不要了，我说我们就就这个形象。现在看起来给人家印象更深刻一些，这我也说不清楚。<笑>首先啊，要高度凝练，去抓住人的一种啊精神本质，大块的白把这个黑啊推举到这种视觉的中心，呈现出来一种非常丰富的视觉的一种冲击感。There wasn't much time left. But Xu Kuang insisted on capturing the soul of the subject. With the keen detail knife, he rendered the hatching tight and dense. And the decisive application of the round blade created the highlights accentuating the sense of volume. The figure's hands gripping his pickaxe speak of a strong willpower. This had to be made visible through rapid, spontaneous cutting. The most original aspect, however, was the front of the dark-colored Tibetan robe. 
，就发现用频道那么咚咚咚咚咚咚咚咚咚咚，木头笔根本没有磕掉，整体是黑的，但又有层次，衬托这个人。With the image translated onto paper, the master sounded an ode to the ancient plateau. After over 40 years, this winner of the National Gold Award still looks vividly fresh in the artist's studio. As a testament to the couple's fruitful career. He also records the moment at the beginning of a new era. As China bid farewell to its long winter in 1978, the master emerged to inspire the nation. Its innovative techniques were widely admired. With their knife. Future woodcut artists have since recorded the life of numerous masters of their own destiny.